The Frozen Particle on YouTube, check out the link in the description below, has sent over, very kindly, Chapter 2 of the Dragon Ball Super manga being written by Toyotaro. So I'm going to go ahead and recap what I read. Now, before we go any further, I want you guys to know that the manga adaptation um, of Dragon Ball Super is not going to be a direct episode-to-episode -episode adaptation. It's coming out monthly in V-Jump. It's not one of those things where it's going to be a direct, like, every scene from the anime is going to the manga. Because remember, the anime is primary in this case, secondary is the manga. Um, what it appears to be is it appears to be a quicker kind of run through of the events of what's going on in the series. And so therefore it's, you know, a little bit different. Um, I think that these manga chapters are going to be used more so to promote the upcoming episodes and as kind of a teaser than an actual adaptation. So it's not going to be one of those things where you can just skip the anime, read the manga. You kind of have to watch the anime to get the whole story. The manga is just going to be used as kind of a promotional tool and as a teaser. Now, without any further ado, let's talk about Chapter 2. There isn't much to say, to be honest. Basically... It's essentially a retelling of the first act of Battle of Gods. Um, Beerus is talking to the Oracle Fish and talking about the SSJ God legend and whatnot. Whis, of course, talks to Beerus about it. And like in the film, he goes to North Kai's planet to, of course, meet with North Kai, which is where Goku happens to be at training. Same thing in both the anime and the manga. So, of course, just like in the movie, it's exactly the same story. Goku wants to fight Beerus. Uh... Kai Osama says, no, you, he's too dangerous. Goku, of course, doesn't care. Now, the first notable difference between the Battle of Gods movie and the manga, and I don't know if this is how it's going to be in the super episode. Um, by the way, for those wondering, I believe this fight will take place. This manga is going to be linked to Dragon Ball Super Episode 5. Um, that's the way I'm kind of seeing it, even though we'll see some of the stuff early. But I think episode 5 is when the fight's going to take place based on the titles that were already leaked. Anyways, the first major difference here is that Goku is going to fight Beerus in his SSJ1 form first. Why is he going to do that? I don't know. It seems a little bit arrogant. It seems a little bit, I don't know, kind of stupid. Because, you know, listen to Kai, you know, obviously. But I guess he doesn't know. I've used the word no a lot, but he tries to fight this guy, and he gets his ass kicked, and then he powers up to SSJ3, and he's like, this is my full power. And that's all well and good, but just like in the film, in fact, it's actually almost a shot-by-shot -shot exact uh, cl scene almost, where Beerus chops Goku in the neck, and he goes down for the count. That's it. Afterward, Beerus is disappointed, and then Whis and Beerus decide to go to Earth to talk to the other Saiyajin to see where the Super Saiyajin Godo legend is on Earth, of course. So, and that's what happens in the movie too. Now, the second most notable change. Now, I had heard I had heard the scuttlebutt that Champa was going to be debuting in Episode Five. Also, this solidifies that rumor that one of my sources told me that Champa was going to be in Episode Five. Well, here we go. Champa has debuted in Dragon Ball Super Chapter 2. And apparently what's going to happen, or what happens in the manga chapter, is that if they tell you, they say, the only person who can sense a god is another god. And, you know, that does kind of coincide with Battle of Gods. So Champa is awoken. He awakes in a different part of the universe. However, what's interesting is it's the same universe. It's not Universe 6. So... Is Champa vacationing from Universe 6? Is he even from Universe 6? Maybe he's from this universe. We don't know if he's from Universe 6 yet. It's just speculation. He could be from the Universe 7 as well. So Champa wakes up, and he's got his assistant, who still does not have a name. And essentially, Champa talks about, hey, Beerus is awake. And Champa's like kind of smiling, like, okay, Beerus must be up, and he's fighting somebody on Kai's planet. And it kind of ends with Champa kind of saying, okay, let's go see what's going on. So it looks like the gods are going to converge so at some point on the earth. So we're probably going to see. It's going to be different than Battle of Gods. The same story, but now Champa's involved. I don't know if Champa's going to fight. Obviously, we're going to know very, very soon. But that's the two major differences. Goku fights him in his previous non-SSJ3 forms, and Champa premieres in Dragon Ball Super Chapter 2 slash Episode 5. 
That's it. That's pretty much all we got. There wasn't much that happened here in, in terms of story. It was mostly just action. Um, I did put. I'm not gonna put the entire manga chapter up like I did the first time, guys, because I'm trying to avoid having my YouTube channel shut down. It ain't happening. So you'll see little snippets here and there, but you're not gonna see the whole manga. And unfortunately, I do not have a link, but I'm sure one of you kind people in the comment section will leave a link for all of our friends. To check out the Dragon Ball Super Chapter 2 manga. I don't have a link because Frozen Particle sent it to me raw like in JPEG format. He did not send me a link to download it. Or at least the link that he did send me didn't work. So he said fuck it and just sent it to me. Thank you Frozen Particle for that. So again, um, if you guys find the manga chapter online. And I'm sure you'll be able to leave a comment with the link. And that way all of our friends can go read it. Um, but that's my thoughts. That's my review on the chapter. It's uh, pretty simple stuff. And um, give me your thoughts also below on what you think. I mean, there's not really much to say. It's kind of the same thing except Champa's there. There's no differences. But uh, hey, thanks for watching. I'll catch y'all down the road.